A dirty discovery made on the Treasure Coast. A call about animal abuse uncovered a possible case of child abuse. Officers say they found young children living among dog and human waste at their home in Fort Pierce. Tonight, the parents of these children are facing charges. We are covering St. Lucie County with the largest news team on the Treasure Coast. News Channel 5's Ricky Klaus joins us live from Fort Pierce with new information. Ricky? Shannon, an animal welfare check kicked off an investigation into what officials call a house of filth. Not only were 13 dogs taken away, three children were too. An animal control welfare check at this house on 44th Street in Fort Pierce led officials to a scene they never expected. Small children living in deplorable conditions. Tonight, Karen Taylor with the St. Lucie County Humane Society spoke to me by phone, detailing exactly what was found when they went inside the home. Three children were in the back room by themselves in a blanket with no clothes on, no lights in the room, and there was feces and urine all over the room. Our news partners at the Scripps Treasure Coast newspapers report there was also feces on the walls and the couch. The Department of Children and Families took the two, three, and four-year-old children in its care. Authorities arrested their parents, 33-year-old Elizabeth Yeary and 28-year-old Robert Yeary. The Yearys are each facing three counts of felony child neglect. They are now out on bond. We went by their house tonight, but the people inside refused to speak to us. <laughs> Animal control officers took the Yearys 13 dogs to the Humane Society. Actually, they were in good condition. They had been taken care of. They were well fed. It looked like they took better care of the animals than they did their children. Social workers say they've been to the Yearys' house before. It's not clear how long the children have been living in what officials describe as horrible and unsafe conditions. The Yearys surrendered their nine puppies and two dogs here to the Humane Society, but they asked to keep the two other dogs. Animal Control says they won't even consider it until the Yearys clean up their house. Reporting live in Fort Pierce, Ricky Klaus, WPTV News Channel 5.